Okay, we're recording. Go. You've seen the second Japan crit. We're covering the two. Number two. You've seen the third. That's the back. That's the back. <laughs> you haven't seen the first. You kind of. You kind of. This messed time. Kind of messed up that intro. We have ignored the the, the, the number four. four. Oh, okay. This thumb is like. Can't see Welcome to Japan. Welcome to Great. Japan Great. Unboxing number three, but it's box number, number four. Now, a little disclaimer. Like I said, I wasn't able to make it the day it came, and so I opened it a little bit, and I thought, no, this isn't right. This isn't right. I, I was unfortunately, well, I wasn't able to do this yesterday. That's when it arrived. It so arrived yesterday. A day late, but, you know, we're still doing day it. Day late, but I had to get him. Okay. I have sampled it. a few uh -huh. of them. Only, only three. I have not sampled any, so a new impression. So, ta -ta 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 -ta. you have long arms. Okay. This is the cover, the back cover. This is the front, very Halloweeny. It's October, October 2015. Well, all right. I already know where we're gonna start. Here's the list of all the stuff. This thing. There's a manga in here. What is that thing? It's called. I'm not gonna read it. This up? It's called Gyutan Umaibo Stick. Umaibo Stick. Go ahead. Have you tried it? Yes. Yuton Oh my boasting. You're giving me that weird look. Oh by the way, drinks this month. Dr. Peppers. N nothing original. Nothing cool. nothing too fancy. Just plain old dog. Okay, well what is it? It looks like a corn dog or like a stick of garlic, almost. Literally a stick of garlic. Okay. I want you to imagine cheese puff. Except spicy. Big and more cheesy, I guess. All right, that's what this thing is. These airy corn sticks come in a huge variety of flavors. This one is Gyutan, a grilled cow tongue dish in Japan. Don't let the flavor discourage you. This salty snack is a tasty flavor experience. Be page eleven for more. That's cow tongue flavor. Okay. It came with three of them, so hmm. apparently I thought it'd be really okay. Actually, pretty good. I didn't like it. I like it. <laughs> we'll, put, we'll put one of these things. <laughs> Alright, next thing for you to try, because I already ate one, are these. Chocolate mini pancakes. Chocolate mini pancakes, that sounds good. Because I already Are ate there one. nutrition facts? Oh, only in Japanese. Based on the traditional red bean filled Japanese snack, Dorayaki, these fluffy mini pancakes are filled with something a little sweeter, chocolate. Okay. Okay. And they taste really good. I'm, I'm, There's only one left, but... Okay. Show, to, show it to the camera. Yeah. Here's here's the pancake. Looks like an Oreo, but it's a pancake. That's really good. Yeah. I wish I was in Japan. By the way, Yoshi World Yoshi World's, World's coming out, and that's why this guy is here. The game's all hype. The off topic. Next Friday. Right, what's next? Next is the Rum Raisin Soft Candy. Receive one of two variations, strawberry or rum raisin. Back. Chewy candies with a thin outer shell that are packed full of delicious flavor. There's probably a secret to opening this. It's, no, it's already open. Just, oh, you already opened yeah, it? Yeah, like I said. These, so, this is, this is where I ended. Oh, it, it's Velcro. Okay. That's not Velcro, that's called a Ziploc. I mean Ziploc. Hey, it's a hard candy. Yeah. It's pink. Looks like a gumdrop a little, but it's not gummy. Hard. Oh. I was about to say soda candy. That's not. But it's ice cream flavored. That's actually really good. Yeah, rum raisin. Japan. Like I said when I tried That's it, good. I don't know what rum raisin tastes like, but it tastes good. That was good. I'll put it like this. Get okay. everything on. What do we got coming next, up next? Which I haven't tried. This is where I stopped. Okay. This. Show the camera. Tohato caramel corn. We okay. got a face of a dude, we got a corn, we got Tohato. A caramel corn snack that's just in time for Halloween. The yeah, texture is more like Cheetos than popcorn. With a subtle salty caramel flavor, just like the Milo sticks, you can find this snack in an array of yummy flavors. Well, it's open. Already. Yes, like I said, I opened it. I didn't eat any. Okay. So, this is my first reaction. Alright, let's see well. it. You know what this reminds me of? A croissant. I don't know why. It's just really small. Mm. You. Kind of, it's like a che it's like a Cheeto, except it's caramel. Except it's caramel flavored. Caramel Cheeto. Caramel Cheetos. I I'd, I'd say it tastes good. 
Well, you liked it. You hated those barbecue Cheetos. I hated those barbecue Cheetos. Speaking so of barbecue Cheetos, those are probably not barbecue Cheetos. They look like ant. We'll get there. That's we'll get there. Next. These thingies look like soda candy. No, nope, that's the wrong one. Oh, never mind, I'll lie. This one. This is the DIY kit, so we'll explain this a little bit later. But that's the next one on the list. Anyways, get that out of their face. Nope. Sorry, I can't be upset anymore. We'll put this right here for now. Okay. DIY kit. Anyway, these things for real now? No, these ones now. Oh, these ones? Where are these? These look like sour, like, strips or something. I think they're holding it up Oh! <laughs> that's better. Grape I... gummy ribbon. We beat. No, we bet you've never had a candy quite like this. A tart grape gummy with a unique soft texture, almost similar to. Play Doh. There's probably a secret way to open this. I'll let you do it. Oh, you let me do it. Alright. It's got nutrition facts on the back, though, in English. You know, there's like this manga in here. Like, it has some girl. And. And. So you're reading it backwards. I'm reading it backwards, but. Yeah, I just, that's just, whoa. As that guy. There's always the character with white hair. So they come in these, like, individually wrapped packets. And it's kind of interesting. Huh. Here. Okay, well. It has instructions for opening it, in Japanese, of course, so, you can't read it. I can't, I can't even open the little packet. Maybe we should be able to open it. There we go. <laughs> There's a secret. You see, this is just wrapped like American stuff, except I can't open American stuff. Right? Ooh, this, is, this feels, yeah, like a really thin strip of Play-Doh. It's really thin. Kind of like got these ridges. Holy crap! In I'm it. not opening these right. There's all these arrows on this strap thing. Oh, oh hey, there we go. Finally. Okay. Yeah, it feels like squishy, like you'd expect. Mm. I'm I'm gonna say it's like a a really soft Twizzler kind of thing. A grape flavored Twizzler. That's, that's kind of the best thing I can describe it as. He doesn't like it, but yeah. looks of his reaction there. These are good. I find them enjoyable. I find that not enjoyable. <laughs> Holy crap! Is it a texture thing, or you don't like the taste? I don't like the taste. Though. Come on! It fell. Okay. Alright, well, get off the morning section. Alright, here's the list. Why is this upside down? Well, those are gross. Don't buy those. I do buy those. Heads up. So, these are not barbecue. Oh, that snap. They look so good, though. Rich cheese scones. We think of these like Japanese Cheetos, but with more creamy and buttery cheese taste. Okay, what well, think? we had the barbecue scones. You liked them, I didn't. You hated them, I loved them. Maybe you'll hate these and I'll love them. Oh my gosh, that would be so anticlimactic. I'll open it, I swear. I don't think anticlimactic is the right word, but we're gonna go with it. After you, good sir. It has a 10% on the front, so... Oh, that smells really cheesy. It's like a cheese egg. It tastes like a... No, I like it. A normal Cheeto or a cheese egg. I like it. What do you think? It's, yeah, it's definitely stronger. I think scones might be my favorite Japanese snack. Like, just based on what we've had from these crates a little. So, yeah. Good. Good. It's a good rating. Don't mind if I, uh... Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Okay. Stick a gum. No. Vitamin C lemon drops. <laughs> yeah. Cool and refresh your mouth with these lemon drops. They're made with a vitamin C so they can help you stay healthy. Well, it literally looks like gum. Well, it's probably not gum. Since it's a lemon drop. Yeah, it's got this little dispenser thing. You can do it. Easy now. So, they say Nobel. Nobel. As in, like, Nobel Prize. Nobel. These snacks won a Nobel Prize for being you can't vitamin even see it. C. It says Nobel, I swear. <laughs> Alright, vitamin C. All health. Ooh, it looks like a vitamin. It's yeah. hard. Kind of like a giant Pez. It kind of reminds me of a giant Pez. Oh, crap, oh, I dropped did. it. <laughs> Oops. There it is. <laughs> okay. I'm working on chewing, I swear. It's like eating a lozenge. Doesn't taste terrible. I'll give it that. 
It's not a terrible smell. Mm mm. It's actually. It's like a lemon. It's like a, just like a lemon. Lemon hard candy. Lemon hard candy. Mm -hmm. It's kind of got that menthol, just Where? a little bit. Come on, Japan Crate. High choos. I know you did that in like your first one. Or whatever. I'm gonna shit this out. Just so I can keep eating the other ones. I'm gonna chew it. You don't chew hard candies. We just we discussed that. I'm gonna chew it. I swear. Are you done? Can you hear my chewing? I can. Yes. What's next? Next! Is it? Yeah. These are it. it tastes like a vitamin! You so, to chew it. These are... Here. Show this camera. These are poiful soda beans. Poiful soda beans. Our packaging here kind of has the word love Wait. over the word poiful. Show that. See, it says called poiful, but um, you can do it. It says loveful. Go figure. So we, we have them. to have some sort of soda candy. Poiful are one of our all-time favorite jelly beans. Try them in four Japanese soda flavors. Cola, ramen, lemon, squash, and cider. Squash? Squash. I'm going to assume those are the yellow ones. I want a squash. I want a ramen. I want a squash. I'm gonna try a squash. I'll try a ramen then. Because I'm not as adventurous as you. Adventure. Yeah. Okay. Well, I took off that side. Nice. Okay, just a second. Just a second. How do you open oh, Stand by while we the problem. I got it. Whoa. Look at this dispenser. It just opens up almost all the way. Why isn't that freaking American? It's like, I want to buy some Skittles. It's just. Oh no, I spilled them. That's awesome. Japanese stuff is like Here, this. This one's yellow, so I'm gonna assume that's squash. This squash. one's blue, I'm gonna assume that's the ramen. Or maybe, yeah, probably. What the heck? Whoa. Let me try one more. That's really chewy. Crap, I took too many. I took four. I'll give you squash and white. Okay. That tastes like ramen, so the blue one's right. Well, I never liked jelly beans, so. These are really chewy. Mm -hmm. Really chewy. Ah, there we go. Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper's life. Yeah, squash aren't bad. I can't really tell them it tastes like a squash, per se. Yeah. Love Maybe it's not. Maybe it's some, like, Japanese squash. Food. Next. Right. The ball. Oh. The drink. That's a soda can. Yeah. Oh. You're, it's your job to hold it up it's to the camera. Nutrition camp. facts. You have the longest arms. What are the nutrition facts? And you get out of this. Couch. Mm -hmm. You know, that's not the most important thing of this. Okay, there we go. What's it say? Burl, viral? Burleys? B Ray Lays Orange. B Ray Lays. This orange drink actually originated in California back in the 1920s but was discontinued. Asahi, one of Japanese, Japan's largest drink manufacturers, was able to begin manufacturing Burleys and is now only available in Japan. Hmm. Well, so we'll was try Californian. That. You try this. I'll too. try. I'll take a sip, and then I'll. I'll try it. with the DIYs. For Look you how it, like, it has instructions for how to. It's like how do you one, open a soda one, can? Push this forward. Yes. Two, push it back. Great. Our our cans don't have instructions on them. Push forward. Okay. Step one. Okay. Push Step forward. Step two. Pull back. Push back. All right. T let's see how it tastes. Drum roll. It tastes like orange juice. No fizz? No. I, think I saw a bunch of, like, stuff coming off of it, but it tastes like orange juice. Yeah, it's like steamy. Okay. We it says an orange drink. It doesn't say it's soda. We got two and a half things left. Two and a half? Mysterious soda balls. Oh, more, more soda, soda candy. We think these are similar in consist cons consistency to Skittles, but with a better taste. Oh. Enjoy seven flavors, pink, lemon, pink, oh, pink lemonade, cider, grape, melon, lemon, squash, and calpis. This one's really easy to open. Calpis. Calpis? C-A-L-P-I-S. Here, you should have a ton. I'll pour some. That's, that's a lot. Whoa, these look like... They're huge! Yeah. Dude, freaking skills, look at the size of these things. I like the size of... I don't know what I was going to say. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Huh. I wonder what calpis is. Those taste more like freaking six foots. You know, six foot candy. Yeah, yeah, six foots. Mm -hmm. I don't I don't find that. I think they taste like just different like flavored Skittles. I like really big six foots. But they're really good. Yeah. I like them. I always like the soda flavors in 
I'm an iffy. I'm such a connoisseur. I tried like some sort of vinegar flavored uh, ramen. I swore it was vinegar. It wasn't. It wasn't vinegar. Okay, this one has a very interesting this smile on it. The this last one of our one and a half. So, sour fruit gummies. Chewy and not too sour with four delicious fruity flavors. Grape, peach, apple, and orange. Sounds pretty generic. Alright, well this one's easy to open as well. Oh, yeah? Let's see that. No, we gotta, eat, we gotta eat first. Wow, that's literally a sour patch kid in there. Except not kid shaped. Mm hmm. So this is orange. Yeah, it's a sour patch kid. Way more chewy. Way more better than a sour patch kid. <laughs> mm. That's good. I like that one. That one gets the A plus plus. A plus plus. This, this, this gets S plus. This is the best thing. <laughs> I love these scopes. Did you rate any of these C minus minus? Mm hmm. You see these things? These <laughs> things get my programming score of C minus minus. I'll make that language one day. You'll see. You are such a programmer. Okay, next. The final bonus item Food Dog Gashapon. Bone, I guess. For this mon month's bonus item, we have these adorable little charms featuring puppies in food. Oh my gosh! They come in Puppy torture! They come in different breeds and munchies. Oh my gosh. What's up with that dog there? He's inside of a sandwich? Look at this. The dog is in the sandwich. He's in the sandwich. What's this represent? At least we got a lazy egg, so we had excuses to be lazy. Well, this, this dog here in the book is in a sandwich as well. This thing is... Yeah. The workings of the devil. No, I'm gonna put I take that back. Backpack at school. Oh my god! Why the heck is that dog in a sandwich? That's so weird. Got, this is like a French toast. It's got like whipped cream and a cherry on top. Japan is so weird. What kind of dog is this? Would you say this is a pug? That's a freaking no. I don't pug. Know. That is it like animal a pug. Torch. It's got like a curly tail. Right? Animal it's a pug. Torch. Squished face, curly tail. Pug. Oh my gosh. In French toast. Oh my god. Thanks, Japan. That was fun. We're not done yet. We got the we got this. Okay, let me read you off the DIY. Read you off the description of that. The description. What is the description of the DIY kit? Cheeto soda DIY. Mix the included powder and water to create your own ramen flavored mochi. Mochi is kind of like a marshmallow out there. Okay, well let's open it. Well, we can't open it up here. We don't have anything to do. Might as well look at the ingredients. No, what we're gonna no, do no. is press go up there. Okay, go up here, hit stop record. Yes, see ya. In a second. Okay. Hello, we're back. The instructions for the DIY are get water. We're not doing the concert, we're doing it here. We're doing it here. This is the soda, I'm gonna try it. I have my measuring cup. Ready. So how's that orange drink? <sighs> it's literally just say orange juice. Yeah. There is no fizz or anything. Dang. It's probably... 100% organic and not natural vitamin C enriched orange juice or Dang, something. I gotta drink the drink. Fancy like that. Mm hmm Okay, so show them the packaging for this thing again. 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 You, we know you love it. So, this is when we open it, right? Yes. Okay. This is when we open it. So, inside we got... Uh-oh. That. And that's it. We got some powders. And right. a mixer. Thingy. And the powders look like this. So first things first, cut the tray. Cut the tray. Well, rip it in half. You Perforated the... edges. Mm. Everyone loves them. It's best part, guys. Okay. I'm gonna go get some water, and I will be back. Walk in front of the screen. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Okay. This is my art of balance. Art of balance touched the video game. I hated that game, by the way. I'm sorry. Yeah. It, it was okay. Anyways, fill number one, which appears to be this green, doesn't say one on here, but the picture shows a green dot. Uh, two line with water. One. The, yeah. I was Mixing a, green. I wasn't just explaining. Mm -hmm. All right, watch me open this and spill the whole. Oh, this is a scoop. Mm -hmm. Scoop. You have any scissors? That's gonna take the. Yeah. Can I? I'm gonna take those scissors. This is the best part of the video on your guys. Okay. Oh crap. <laughs> don't oh, do don't that. Don't drop my scissors. Don't do that at home. Okay. Build to the line. 
Here is the green powder. Mixing green packet to one. Alright. It's like a cooking show. But Japan edition. In a way, it's still straight one with mixture. I just did that. Um, you're gonna need to distribute contents of pink packet and mix. Wait, what the? No. Fill tray one with mixture. Okay. Right? What are we doing here? Stir. Stir. Okay, we're trying to know what we're doing. This thing he's mixing, this blue, we put into this. And then we put this into that, right? Yeah. And no, we put this into this. Then what's this? This goes into this, which goes in, which this has, this goes into that. And then this you, goes on top you, of you'll this. You'll see it. Okay, so. Drum roll. This isn't take too long. Take too long. Cut it in. No, I'm good. It's got a little chlory thingy. Let's see. Look at my skills. You guys can't see this, I'm sorry. I can't move. Yeah, let's do that. And then you'll have a bunch of leftover. Just pour a little more to I didn't get his good. Okay. All six of them have things. All six and of we them get have like things. an ice cube tray. It looks like an ice cube tray. And we get this. <clears throat> we cut it. Okay. And we get pour it. Carefully or evenly distributed contents of pink packet and mix. So even distribution. Nice job. He just poured all this crap in. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe that works. There's a lot of it. So. There's a lot of it. Okay, yeah. And mix. This is so fun. I th we gotta move this. We gotta let the people see. That's what he's doing. But he's kind of just kind of gave up. <laughs> okay. This part's boring. This part is not as entertaining as. Okay, we cut out the boring crap out. Basically, we poured the blue packet into this. And we're pouring this into this, and we're glazing the mochi. I believe is what it's called. Yes. And then we eat it. Then we eat it. Always a good end of a sentence. Unless it's like poison. Watch, it's like you're supposed to freeze it. Doesn't say freeze. Oh, okay. So, mm -hmm. let me just kind of spread it around. Make sure it looks all nice and pretty. Well, we lift it. Lift it up. Show the lovely show people. Show the world. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, all right. I'm and gonna, you I'm, shall. I'm try gonna dig in first. So I just kind of scooped it out. It looks like sort of like a jello with blue on top of it. Purple jello, blue on top of it. Mm -hmm. I had a really weird flavor. Hmm. I don't have a spoon. Do you want me to wipe this off? We okay, have acquired a spoon. spoon. So I'm gonna try one. Yeah, that one's good. You get it? Yeah, there you go. He doesn't like this one either. Can you believe that? He really doesn't like this one. <laughs> he is just dying over there. I'll try it again. Oh, God bless Dr. Pepper. That is disgusting. It's got a very slight fizz. It feels like I'm tasting flavored saliva in like. Yeah, I that yeah, it's not too far off. It's like someone's got a bunch of wet stuff and then put flavor on it. It's very interesting. Mm hmm. Wouldn't say it's bad. Wouldn't say it's not good. I wouldn't say it's good either. Okay, well, in conclusion. In conclusion. What was your favorite item? My favorite item was the chocolate mini pancakes. Even though you didn't see me try them, they were really good. Show them the packaging. This is your My favorite? These things. Hallelujah to scones. Man, I need to order like a crap ton of those. Right. These were disgusting. I hated these. Least favorite. That's my least, least favorite. favorite was this those, is second least favorite. Is this Yuton stick? Well, thank you very much. Good start. No, I'm <laughs> okay, well, and then we have I'm our little one. French toast bulldog. That's creepy. He's going on my back. Anyway, 
Anyways, this has been Sonic Slow. And Gaming Likers. We'll be doing more of this every month. Right. Now on. Forever. Maybe. See ya.